Oh no, it turns out they are. It, it turns out things are happening, guys. There might be... <laughs> oh my goodness! Okay, well, it's just got worse. <laughs> I can't see anything. I actually can't see a single thing. Okay, what? What is... What is happening? Alrighty, hello guys! Welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we're actually going to be checking out someone's awesome creation. Now this thing is called the SAE 601 Raven Scar, and uh, it is a plane. Now it is a weird looking plane, don't get me wrong, uh, but we're going to have to use that to get off the island today, as there is a tsunami on its way. I haven't actually checked out this plane before though, so let's go ahead and open up the doors and see what it looks like. Look at that thing! What is it? Okay, so like I said, there is a tsunami on the way, so you have to just get into this thing and uh, hopefully not die. Uh, this is the boarding door, let's go ahead and jump on inside, there we go. Uh, lights, let's go ahead and whack those on, that is the toilet, don't need that right now. Uh, and this is the passenger bay on the bottom. It actually has a full-on kitchen down here. Why does it have a kitchen? Alright, but that's not what we need. We actually need to get upstairs in order to get to the uh, the pilot's bit because that's where we need to get to in order to not die. Now, uh, that's the plan anyway. Go ahead and close that up. Let's go ahead and turn on the other lights. Open the crew quarters. There is a place to sleep and a place to sit. Nice. Alright, make our way upstairs. We now have more lights. Okay, there are lights everywhere. We have a system right here for navigation and also, I guess, a channel for talking and stuff. Anyway, um, the seat appears to be broken. We are slowly going sideways. I don't know how this is going to work. <laughs> I really don't know how this is going to work. Okay, order engine start. I've pressed it. Is it going to work? I don't know. Navigation lights are on. The engine start is not happening. I'm a little bit scared now. Okay, I've went downstairs. Key buttons are right here and right here. And now I guess it'll start. I don't know. Press 4 again. Oh, okay, right there. Oh my, they're working. They are working. Okay, pitch up. Okay, this isn't gonna be good. <laughs> this isn't this. I can see the tsunami. I need to get down. I need to push this sideways so that we can take off. This is gonna be crazy. Is that water? No. Okay, open the door. We need to push it sideways with our body. Are we even that strong? We can't move this. Oh no. Oh no. Is it because the packet breaks on? Quick! Go, go, go! Up the, up the ladders! Up the ladders again! Go, go, go! Turn the parking brake off! Okay! Run back that down the stairs! Come on! We gotta be quick! Go, 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 go! Come on! I can do this! Go, 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 go! Oh, tsunami's right there! I'm scared! I'm getting back inside! I don't even care! <laughs> oh no! Oh no, it's here! Ah! <laughs> no, okay, right, this isn't working the way I wanted it to. Alright, yes! Okay, at least we have a bit that's airtight. That's lucky. Holy! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna die anyway! Oh no! <laughs> the airtight thing, I should have closed the door. That was stupid. Oh, it's all flooding out anyway. Okay, so we survived. And actually, the plane itself also survived? Question mark? How has that happened? Alright, I have, I have an idea. Let's go and turn off this engine. Alright, if I could turn off all the engines, that'd be great. Okay, there we go. And no, we are fully sideways now. This isn't gonna work. Luckily, we have access to more than one plane. So, this is our plane. Let's go ahead and jump in again. At least you know how to take off this time, so we're just going to go ahead and do that. Uh, open this door. There we go. Climb up the ladder. Turn this engine on. And this engine. And we just got to go straight away. We just got to go straight away. Okay, press 4. Press 1. Okay, hopefully we can actually get out of here. Yes! Okay, we're doing it! We crashed a little bit, but we're fine. Okay, rotate the seat. Oh, yeah! Is this gonna take off? <laughs> Look at it! Oh, it's such a weird vehicle! Alright, come on, get us into the sky, please, buddy. Uh... Uh... We're running out of runway. <laughs> oh, no, we are running out of runway. Oh! Ah! That didn't work! Oh no! Oh, I fully understand now! Okay, so there is actually like a, uh, a thing on the workshop by, built by Thales or Tails or Talas, however you want to pronounce their name. Um, uh, which essentially is called Weightworks. And essentially the way that works is... Um, hang on, can I... Oh, look at that! 
Uh, essentially, the way weight works is works, <laughs> and I can't speak right now, is that essentially everything is weighted so that it flies a little bit more normally. But I didn't realize this was one of those, so we do actually legit need a really long runway to uh, make this work. So um, here it is. We're on the runway, and we're going to go down it. Are we going to be able to take off, though? I'm not sure. Okay, so we are trundling down the runway again. I didn't actually read what I needed to do last time, but apparently you need to do the prop pitch at uh, specifically 0.65. We have done that this time, so hopefully we will be able to take off. Uh, uh, yeah, indicated airspeed. As soon as I sit at like 34, uh, we should be able to actually get into the sky. There we go, 34. Let's go ahead and pitch up. And there we go. Nice. We're actually flying this thing. Awesome. However, it is actually incredibly loud, so uh, that's a thing. Anyway, landing lights can go off, altitude holds can go on, and we are now flying the whale, I'm going to call it the whale, through the sky. Wonderful. You know, I was just thinking, actually, it looks a little bit more like Dory than it does a whale, so maybe we should call it Dory. I don't know. Uh, well, anyway, we are flying. Uh, we do want to not do very much to this, because it will fall out of the sky. It does have quite a lot of fuel, though, so uh, we will just keep it going. In fact, let's go ahead and turn off altitude hold. We'll go up into the sky a lot, uh, if we can't indicate... Oh, no. Okay, pitching up is a bad idea. It loses airspeed instantly. <laughs> It loses airspeed so quickly, actually. Yikes. Okay, try and keep that around 34, and we will keep ascending. And then once we've done that, we'll go ahead and whack on our altitude hold. And hopefully, we can actually be able to go downstairs. Because I want to go down there and have a little look around. Okay, altitude hold is on. Let's go ahead and turn our seats. Get out of our seats. Go ahead and turn this guy on. We can see. Nice. Go down the stairs, down the ladders. Excellent. We can't actually seem to get to that bit. But I want to try and figure out if I can. So let's go downstairs again, open this up, and yeah, I don't see a way of getting further forwards. This is the steward's seat. Okay, hang on. Are we are we pitching down? It looks like we are, but I'm not sure. Uh, where are the lights? There we go. I need to go back upstairs because it looks like we're going to die. Okay, hang on. Go back up. Here we go. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. We're fine. Right, let's try and follow the river. That'll be a scenic route, won't it? Let's go that way. Okay, so the way to get over there, we just go ahead and do this. And now we can actually get into the engine room where there are multiple engines. There seems to be, what, six engines in here? Okay, powering two propellers. That's really cool. That is actually really, really cool. Look at that. Wow. All right, okay. Well, we don't want to be in here anymore because we don't need to be. But I do want to have a little look at this cabin as well. So let's turn the lights on in here and see what we can see. So there is a full-on kitchen. Let's go ahead and turn on the hob. Nice. We got a bunch of uh, drinks and stuff right there. Cocktails, if you want them. And then a million seats. Okay. Did we check the toilet before? We didn't. But you can sit on the pooper if you want to. And um, flush the toilet as well. Oh, that's the sink. The sink actually works. Nice. Okay. I need to get back upstairs just in case we are about to crash. Okay. Hang on. Close this up. All right. Get back. Okay. Yeah. No, we were about to crash. That would have been awful. Okay. Keep turning. It doesn't turn very quickly, and you don't really want to either, but it's cool. It's very cool. All right, so I'm not entirely sure what we want to do now. I'm just going to go ahead and fly, I guess, towards the volcano and uh, maybe try and land somewhere around there because I think it would be really cool down there. Um, oh, I don't have the... So the, there is like a mod that adds a runway here. That would have been really cool for this thing, but unfortunately, uh, we don't have it. Oh, that's a bit of a yikes. Alright guys, I'm not going to lie, I might have pressed a bunch of buttons and things might happen, but things might also not happen as well. Oh no, it turns out they are. It, it turns out things are happening, guys. There might be... <laughs> oh my goodness! Okay, at least we've got a respite from the sound. There are meteors everywhere. Holy moly! Look at it! Oh my, the big ones are hitting. The big ones are hitting, guys! I need to take a picture of this, I'm sorry. 
All right, well, I'm just going to leave. So, yeah, see ya. I'm out of here. Bye, guys. <laughs> I don't know whether there's going to be a tsunami or anything or a rogue wave, but I'm just going to leave. Um, actually, everything... Why is it shaking so much? Oh, it is so shaky. Oh, my. Is that literally due to that? It must be. Oh, my. Okay, well, I'm just going to continue out of here and try and find somewhere to land. See ya. Okay, well, that was really weird. It actually just turned really foggy really quickly, and I'm not entirely sure why. But, uh, yeah, flying through the fog seems very dangerous, especially in something like this, where we can't change altitude all that easily. We might actually just fly into a hill. I don't want to, but that might be what happens. Okay, well, it's just got worse. <laughs> I can't see anything. I actually can't see a single thing. Um, okay, well, I guess... I don't know what you do in this situation. I'm going to go ahead and start going down to hopefully see the shore. And then if I can see the waves or the, the, the river, I can follow the river. But I can't see anything so far. What's our altitude? Uh, that's our indicated airspeed. Altitude is actually quite high. Let's go ahead and start lowering ourselves down. Okay, we're at 100. I can't see anything. We are at 90. I still can't see a single thing. This is scary. <laughs> this is so scary. Okay, keep going down. Okay, I see trees. I see trees. Oh my goodness. Okay, only just though. Only I only just see trees. Okay. Uh oh, a clearing. No. Yes. I don't know why, where I am. I don't know where I am. Trees, there's a hill. Oh, that was close. Where am I? I'm not there. I'm literally about to fly over a runway. Okay, this is our chance. <laughs> this is our chance to land in the worst weather. Okay, here we go. Go ahead and press two. Oh, that's a horrible noise. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, that was an awful landing, but it also sort of worked. That is lucky. That is extremely lucky. Okay, turn our seat so we can get out of here. Uh, turn the parking brake on. Come on. Excellent. Okay, what? What is... What is happening? What is going on? My guy! I'm upside down and my... I'm... What? <laughs> oh, okay, this makes more sense now. There's a tornado and we are being pulled around in it. Okay. Yeah, we're dead. We're, we're actually dead. Is there a parachute on board? I didn't see one. I, I don't... Oh, God. Okay. I don't think there's anything I could do. I'm just... I'm just stuck in this thing. Okay, I'm going to try the great escape. Let's go ahead and get out. Oh, my God. Oh, I've just... Okay, I'm now stood on the outside. Of course I am. How has this happened? I don't understand. <laughs> Why am I now on the outside? Also, the plane's, like, actually so far in the sky. It might be the highest the plane's been in this video. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, now it's going down. No, we're still flying. We're still fine. Let me back inside. I'm so stuck. This is stupid. Okay, is there a seat I can get in? Is there a seat? There isn't. There's no seats. I'm... I'm... Okay, now it's on fire. Oh, my goodness. Help. Somebody help me. Help. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm so dead. I'm so... No, I'm actually fine. I don't know what's going on. I'm confused. I'm just confused. Oh. How long does this go on for? Because it's just taking us away now. I, I'm just stuck on the outside and it is taking us away. What in the... Oh, no. I've been thrown away from it. Oh, I'm being catapulted back into it. Holy. Okay. Okay. Now we're backwards. Now we're upside down. Okay. Help. Somebody help me. I can't even get out of it because the... I've been glitched out of the plane. I'm just stood on the outside. I just want to die at this point. Kill me. Kill me. Uh-oh. It is actually happening. I am burning. Um, but, I, yeah. I, there's nothing I can do. I'm just... I, I'm just in a tornado and I'm burning and I'm stuck. And I, I don't know. I, unless this tornado stops and sort of, like, throws me out, I am just going to be stuck in here anyway and still die. Even if the tornado leaves... No, I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Oh, GG. GG, guys. Hot diggity dog. What a video this was. What a pain in the butt this was, too. Ah, interesting.
Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here for now. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy it. And I'll link it down below if you guys want to check out that plane. It is awesome. It uses weight works. So you should definitely check it out. But anyway, for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.